Hello, combat sports fans. This is Karate Combat, and I am Phoenix Carnavali alongside Boss Rudin. And we've got a great matchup for you with this one. David Schreiras oh, yes. in the red gloves versus Saeed Ahmadi with the blue. And expect some fireworks here. Ferreras is known for his aggressive style. So uh, this guy is going to come forward and let's see what Amadi's going to do with it. Amadi can handle this. He is a counterfighter with a very, very high IQ. Yeah, won a silver medal at the 2012, 14 and 16 world championships. This guy He's right here, Saeed Amadi. Davis Ferreras from Dominican Republic. Yes, Davis took first place in 2016's Pan Am Karate Championships in Rio. Oh, there we go. Amadi from wow. Iran. Amadi began karate when he was eight years old. Round one. That's a, the best age to start. You ready? Fight. Show of respect. All right. Ooh, Ferreras right away. You see, it's like a bowl of fire in there. Something's brewing in him. Nice little takedown there. Didn't do anything with it. No points for nobody. Oof. Well, just understanding the, the techniques a little bit here. When a knockdown occurs from a legal maneuver other than a takedown, the standing opponent may follow through with immediate action on a grounded opponent. And they can only strike with their hands, right, once they're down? Yes. A nice takedown there by Amadi. Yeah, you see Ferreras constantly coming forward, but you said it. Said is countering, not at this moment, but he did before. If you look at the overhead display, you can see a little bit of what our fighters are going through right now as far as their heart rate and their stats. Okay. Oof. Nice. Nice Washington combination to the too. head. Yeah. And you see Two that step in my gutty, that sidekick really just digs into your opponent's ribs. And there we have the jackhammers raining down. <laughs> this particular case was not plural, just jackhammer. One. The big sweep. We see this a lot. We see it also used a lot as like a jab, like as a distraction move, and then they go on top. Very wide stance. Nobody wants to be taken down here. Referee breaks it up, there's just no action in the clinch. The referee will break it up. Yeah, and it keeps them from using the clinch as a resting period. You know, you can be very effective in the clinch with knees and... Man, if I was uh, Said Amadi, I, I would wait for his opponent. He's loading up his right hand the whole time. Just wait for the right moment, duck underneath, and come in for a counter. Again, just using the kicks not only just as strikes, but as distance tellers. And I like the distance where they throw them from. That was very nice. That counts. They got some points. Ferreras is posturing now, too. He's just letting him know. But the referee is warning him, though. He's, he's holding the back of his head. Again, that is an illegal blow. Hitting to the back of the head is an illegal blow. 10 seconds. Again, Ferreira's kind of baiting and moving forward. Beautiful takedown. And beautiful reverse from that. Very nice. And that ends our first round. As you were saying, Boss Ferreras with the aggression, really beautiful sidekick that he threw towards the middle of that Yokogri Ichidan, which puts Ahmed down. So Ten seconds. looks like he possibly took that round. Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, most of the time that happens also the aggressor, at least at, especially when they are scoring and he, he was scoring. Round two. Scoring always goes to the advantage of the more aggressive fighter, but the more effective techniques will score as well. As we set into round two. 
Ooh, look at the speed on that right front kick, uh, side kick that he was throwing. Front leg kick. Amadi here, so you just see on the back foot a little bit as Ferreras being more aggressive. Nice single leg there. Yeah, he gave it to him. He came with the big right hand, closed the distance, and there's the takedown, the single leg. Mahdi is doing a good job with his level changes and shooting for those takedowns. Nice, Yoko Giri, shoot on to the body. Oof! And <laughs> just missed. Very close. <laughs> Looks like Ferris was slowing down a little bit in this round. It's nice though, I like what he does. You know, Yoko Gear right away in Marwashi with the same leg. So side kick, roundhouse kick. Yeah, Mati really using that side kick well. As a Ferris. Let's you help know, you up. Just helping his opponent up. There we go. Respect. And here we are in this back to the center of the pit. Ferreras with a nice straight body punch. Yep, he's really good with that, but he loads him up. She has to watch out that he's not telegraphing. Mari again using that low kick. Again I landing, and connecting with the low kick. Yep, but follow it up. If you bring your opponent off balance, might as well keep going, right? Well, it's beautiful because he was going for the, the spinning hook kick, and you can see Ferreira saw that coming and jammed it. We are moving into our third round. Boss, how would you score that round? Ooh, yeah, a it's a very hard one because uh, Amadi is having great counter strikes, but I think the aggressor and still the person who, who connects the most will be Ferreira's. Round three. So I think it's leaning towards him. by both fighters when they recover. Yeah, and the impact also from that sidekick, you know, you're some literally flying backwards. It's all about the weight distribution, you know, because there was not a big load up for that kick, but at the last possible moment, he put his body weight in there. Yeah, what's Look great at the speed about it is also the high kick. he uses it as his opponent's coming in. Yeah, Amadi's doing a great job now. Ferreras looking to use it as well, changing his levels. This has been the, the sidekick expedition from both fighters. Wow, very nice. Man, Amadi feels completely comfortable in the corner, right? He doesn't even try to get out, he loves it. He's just looking for an opening. Ferreras nice. uh, with a low blow. Hmm. Let's play sweep again. Sweep the leg, Johnny. <laughs> Karate kid. There it is. Ferreras just a little bit outside, but Amadi did a good thing by just swaying back by just a couple inches and keeping that, keeping himself away. You can see they're really interested in blitzing forward. Ferreras throwing a one-two combination. Nice left kick the key to the body eye there. by Amadi after the Mwashigeti to the body. Yeah, Amadi, really good counter striker. It's going to be hard to judge this whole match. As we see them step back into the center Ten of the seconds. pit, they're both trying to control that center. They're both trying to figure each other out and come with the counter striker. You can see they're trying to set bait. Nice job there. You know, side kick and right away go over into a takedown. Yeah, Beautiful. Mahdi ends that round with the double leg takedown. All right, now it's taking it to the judges to find out the decision. 
Taking a look at it here, these are their preseason bouts. They do not count against a fighter's record. The regular season will begin on April 26th in Miami. The winner by scoring is Red Davis Ferraras from Dominican Republic. And he's got Republic. it. The aggressor got it. And by the way, this event is sponsored by the Bitcoin Project, a non-profit organization that aims for, to educate people and raise awareness of Bitcoin through public events. Be sure to follow us at Karate.com for more information about these fighters and, of course, more fights. Wow, this was great. Yeah, I really like it when you excited. see two different styles, eh? Yeah, it's cool. It's really cool. The crisp strikes in and out.